pocket? Uh, well, what can I say? It's the first. We were very hungry. You know, did that album. We were. Uh, we had our sound. Everything was finished. We've been rehearsing those songs for long, for years. Yeah. So it was recorded and mixed in 12 days, which is fucking amazing when you think about it. You know. Um, I like that album. We play a song from that album on this tour. Oh. I like it better than the second one because the sound is better and uh, you can hear the band is like you know, you know finally you get to record something that was our first ever recording we never recorded anything before that album okay so and then morning rise the morning rise was uh, I, we were kind of pretentious i brought a lute to the <laughs> recording you know a lute yeah 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 we played a lot of chess we were intelligent But it was, uh, it's good. It's a good album. I think sound-wise, it's not good. I hate, I hate the sound. It sucks, you know. And um, you know, it's. I don't really listen to that album so much anymore. But it has some good songs. And at the time, you know, to be your farewell songs like that was quite. Un you know, nobody did anything like that. If you had anything to do with death metal, so that opened a lot of doors. I think mm -hmm. it's a popular, very popular record. Yeah, some of your diet, not my opinion, but some of your diet, finally. Yeah, it's the best one. Is the best one. Yeah, yeah, and I appreciate that, you know. <laughs> it's as important as the new one in a way, you know. For the time, I was, you know, that was, I was so happy with that record. In retrospect, I don't like the sound, really, production. But the songs are good, you know. I yeah. Think. And so, My Arms, Your Ears? Well, it's a, tr a little bit troubled album because half of the band <laughs> left, basically. We fired the bass player and uh, Anders, the drummer, quit. So we had, it was the first album for Lopez. And he wasn't experienced, you know. It was rough recording for him. Mm -hmm. And I wasn't happy with the album when we were finished. I thought it was shit. But uh, the, the more I listened to it, the more I started to like it. And now and I love it, you know. It's cold, it's dirty, and it's uh, evil, you know. It's, uh, it's, uh, it, that's one of the albums that has the most kind of spirit about it you know it's something about that album is uh, it's weird you know We, you would you could never reproduce an album like that it's impossible <laughs> it's sloppy as well but it's it's a good album it has i think all the songs are very good on that album so it's one of my favorites i think okay and then still life another favorite you know that's a really really good album that's a complicated mm -hmm. record you know the music is complicated i can You know, and I think about like, how the fuck did I come up with that stuff, you know. Because that's when I started writing completely alone. Mm -hmm. So all the three previous records, you know, my arms were rehearsed, I started writing more alone as well. But the first two, me and Peter wrote, you know, I did basically most of the music anyways, but we wrote together. And my arms, I started writing more on my okay. own. And then still life completely alone. So uh, I'm very happy with the, the, the music. We didn't rehearse for that. That's when we stopped rehearse. So we didn't rehearse for that recording, but it was a good, smooth recording. We were in full band again, Mendes mm -hmm. joined. Uh, so it was, a, it was a nice recording, the album came out great. It's a popular record. Yeah. I like it. Okay. And then uh, Blackwater Park? A big record. Mm -hmm. no, <laughs> so many people consider our breakthrough, whatever yeah. record. Which I guess in some, <laughs> in opinion, some way it is. I think it's a fantastic record. I'm very happy with that. Very proud of those songs. Uh, the recording session was kind of nice, mm -hmm. and that's when we started touring, basically. We, you know, from the first album up to the Blackwater Park, we had did, done one tour. So we signed to Music for Nations, and we got an agency, and started touring, basically. And since then, we've been out on the road, constantly. <laughs> and uh, then Deliverance? Uh, Deliverance and Damnation, I can, you know, mm. it's like one album in a way for me, especially the recording process. It was rough. Mm. The band was in trouble, personal problems. You know, Martin Lopez started feeling sick around and okay. there. Um, and uh, the recordings were awful, horrible. That was, you know, <laughs> the end of the band, I thought, you know. Uh, I was, didn't have any songs finished, so I wrote all the songs mm -hmm. for both albums in the studio and no rehearsals. So it was too much work. I got sick after that recording, physically <laughs> and mentally ill. You know, just basically didn't want to do it anymore. But Damnation came out fantastic and Deliverance, considering what we went through, came out really, really good. But it has the last song, uh, I'm not 100% satisfied with. Yeah. 
with a real vocal. Uh, no, I, li I like, you know, yeah, yeah, from, but, from uh, the beginning uh, until a certain part, I feel it should have ended, you know, where I just okay. wanted some riff in, you know, I yeah. could hear how, how I was thinking, like, but that riff, I want that in, so just threw it in. And it, the, the <laughs> arrangement is bad on, on the, the last couple of minutes of the last song. Uh, but Deliverance is one of our best songs. Mm. Uh, Fair Judgment, I it's love that cool, song. Yeah. Master Apprentice is a really, really good song. Breath also should have been edited a little bit, but it has some really, really good moments. So overall, it's a very good album. It's just not 100%. You know what I mean? And the recording was so bad that I have bad memories about it. Damnation is a fantastic record. Mm -hmm. You know, I love it. I'm very happy, and I don't have bad memories about that, even <laughs> though it was recorded at the same time. So I think that's the way the music speaks to you. Damnation has some more hopeful sound. Deliverance is just black, pitch black, all the time. <laughs> Uh, yeah. And okay, and maybe Ghost Forever is to up to date to have a, a thought about it or maybe? well, you know, right, you know, it's it, it is it's new, so I can't mm -hmm. really look back, mm -hmm. you know. But it's uh, it's my favorite record right now, you know, <laughs> because it's the new one. <laughs> the production is the best we've had. Mm -hmm. uh, the execution from our side is the best we've ever done. It's perfect. I think. I think the yeah. vocals are the best. Uh, the vocals are, yeah. I'm really happy with those. Song wise, song structures, I think are. Uh, you might, you know, you might say another song or previous record is better. For, for me, the song structures are perfect on this album. There's no flaws like on Deliverance. So I'm very happy with the songs. I'm very happy with everything about this album. It's uncanny. Maybe it's the. Maybe we should end it here, you know. <laughs>